boys back at it again we're here planting job is complete check it out this is two hundred thousand dollars in plants completed in 15 days three weeks three working weeks all we had to do was a lot of work now let's go walk you around then we are here on this lovely project that we completed in a very timely manner i dropped eighty-five thousand dollars in plants so first i'd like to gather your attention to this beautiful <sighs> japanese maple that we had to replant that died but then all these right here all of these all of these bad boys this is what we call in the professional landscaping field these are called podocarpus gladiators and they are a very nice type of plant they will be a green wall of privacy you could literally if you own this home you could literally walk outside of your house out of your front door in about a year naked and no one would know because you have a nice green wall of fence it's pretty nice most dif difficult things that we've ever planted in the history of our uh, company career besides the redwoods are these trees right here this was extremely difficult this was a 180 inch box we had to get six cranes here two helicopters and the fire department but we did it but people not in the industry they call them trees the next thing i would like to show you is a professional thing that in the industry that we like to call mulch mulch has been spread everywhere we have about 35 40 yards of mulch i don't remember how much we have weed block down and mulch now you be like t i'm wondering how did you install these trees there's 52 of these gladiators Podocarpus gladiators. Well, I'll tell you what, little Johnny. It was pretty simple. We dug a trench, literally a trench all around the property. And when the trees came, we just go pop, 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 pop. Take the boxes out, fill them in with dirt. The easiest way to plant these trees. And it was only possible because of excavator. This right here, this is called travertine. I didn't actually do this because I was too expensive for the homeowner, so they found someone else. But these are called king palms. Beautiful palm. Beautiful. These are little palm trees. These are very cool. Also these. So we had one, two, one, two, three, four, five. Five little palm trees. And then come to the kicker right here. Okay, these we actually planted. So these trees actually went in with zero problems whatsoever. They're the, probably the easiest things we've ever installed. There's three of them. They really make up a good majority of the price because each of the, each of these trees is ten grand. Seventy thousand dollars in plants right there. Isn't that crazy? Installed by the way. Don't be don't be don't be messaging me. Oh T, I live in Southern California. We can get these trees for ten dollars. Shut up. These are fruitless olives. Man, I'm gonna be honest with you, these this is pretty dope. Like this is probably one of my favorite projects that we've done. Um we didn't do the hardscape, but still, like this is really, really sweet. In a year time in a year's time, this place is gonna look totally different. It's gonna look freaking awesome. I'm definitely gonna come back to check this out. In my opinion, love it. I love the design, love the plants. The general contractor was hired to do the driveway, so he did it. And one thing we didn't know is how do we get water from here to there? Usually when we do driveways, we also we always install sleeves right by the curb. We put a three inch sleeve, boom, call it a day. We didn't know where the sleeve was, so we can't get water. So literally the homeowner's been hand watering. So the guy that installed this finally answered the phone. He came out and he found it. Ta-da, right there. There's two three inch sleeves. Next thing we gotta do is get roses. And once the roses come in, we're just gonna plug them in. Bada bing, bada bing. Job is done. Let's go, baby. Let's run the time lapse. I don't understand why you're so alone. You had me at alone. I don't understand why you're so alone.
That's it, boys. Hope you enjoyed the show. This is called the Applewood Home Improvement Show, and it was a pretty fun project. If you want to see stuff like this from the inside, I know YouTube's very short, 10, 15 minute video, but if you want to see how I run the company from inside, inside, join Goat Gang. I promise you, I will change your life. If not, you can leave. And then you bake tea. It didn't change my life. Give my money back. I'll be like, all right, here you go.